everybody. I'm Kelly. Hey guys, I'm Randy. And this is our inaugural video on our channel, Force Finds. We are a husband and wife team from Northern Virginia and we like to sell on eBay and we've been selling for about a year. On this channel we want to share our favorite sales on eBay for the past year and we're only going to highlight the top 10. All right. So our first item is a red Ellie Smith Moon and Stars cake platter from the 1960s. Um, I found this in a thrift store in Northern Virginia and I paid $15 for it. It sold for about $170 and we netted a profit of $146.79 after fees and taxes and shipping. Yep. Alright, so our second one on the list was a not sure how to say this word, Workala Rosenthal Studio Line Base. Um, it's a matte finished base, a uh, very rare base that we picked up. Um, we had it listed, we sold it for $59.20 and we profited $35.98 after fees and taxes. We found that one at a state sale. It was really nice. Okay, the next one is a vintage tile mosaic art piece that the subject was a sailor girl. And this one, um, I do not know how to say the artist's name. Can you say that? Because you're good at that. Um, Eleni? Eleni Michaelidis, maybe? Okay. We'll put the name up. Yep. And um, we found this one at our local Goodwill and thought it was pretty neat and had great quality. We listed it for about $45 and we net profited $32.48. Alright, our next item was a uh, set of highball barber glasses from the George Briard. Yes. Um, who had a set of five they were blue, blue, green, and gold mosaic, and uh, so we sold these for fifty dollars and seventy cents, and we profited twenty-five dollars and ninety-two cents. All right. So, oh, mid-century Fostoria heirloom blue opalescent bowl. It was a shallow bowl. We found this at a estate sale, which this uh, particular estate sale had a lot of uh, Fostoria heirloom pieces, and we picked up quite a bit. We listed this for about $125, and we net profited $87.61 after fees and shipping. Next item <laughs> was a rare Starbucks mug, um, 2011. It was a Bone China Dragon 16 ounce coffee mug um, that very rare uh, we picked up. and. Uh, Kelly actually picked it up and we sold it for $56.40. Profited $40.32. That's right. That was a pretty neat mug. It was. Alrighty, next we have a Vintage Fire King red polka dot grease jar and lid. And these are very rare also to find. Um, we listed it for $54 and it sold for $54 and uh, we profited $37.47. Okay. Our next item was a vintage Noritake um, lidded serving dish with a Christmas ball pattern. Um, so we sold it for $80.84. After fees and taxes, we profited $61.59. Alright, our next item is vintage Yamazuki, Yamazaki, Yamazaki, yeah. Demi Toss cups and saucer set. Um, it was a set uh, of 
cup and saucer, but we had three of them, and this person bought all three of them. And it has the lithopane geisha at the bottom. If you hold it up to the light, you can see the geisha through it. It had a, a blue flower pattern. I wasn't sure of the name of the pattern, so I did not list it with the name of the pattern. Um, it sold for about $70, um, all three of them. And we net profited $38.97. All right, and our last final item, I believe it's our last one, Yes. Um, was probably one of my favorites that we found was a porcelain platter that was hand-painted, um, signed by the artist, I don't have the artist's name down here, um, it was white blue, it was a really cool uh, painting, I thought, um, but we sold it for $71.58, profited just over $49. Okay, well we're going to keep this video short and sweet since we're newbies and we're sure our content at this time is a little dry. And um, we appreciate you watching all the way through. If you could, like and subscribe and we will be putting out more videos um, of a little different nature. Um, hopefully some of us shopping and some of us, um, you know, doing summaries of what has sold. All right, thanks guys, appreciate your time, and uh, check back in for our next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.